Part two of my multiple marketplace strategy. You're shopping for used cars, use this to get better deals than everybody who's not using this. Subscribe to make sure you can stop shopping the old way. You wanna put in your criteria based on your pre-approval. If you watch some of my other videos, you know you should have a pre-approval so you know how much you can spend. You don't have a pre-approval, at least go to an online uh, payment calculator and find, put in your monthly budget, find out how much money you can borrow. And here's the goal. I need to see what the low side is of the market on this car and what the high side is. You're looking at all these websites and you're trying to see the the low side of the market is always going to be terrible cars flooded titles rebuilt frame damage structural that's okay you need to see that low point then the high side is always going to be overpriced car now you're getting an idea of what a good price would be on this car because i want to be closer to that low side but for a quality car which means i might not find it today but i'm going to turn on my alerts and part three i'm going to tell you how to narrow it down totally based on accident service records and then calling before you go so you can ask two very important questions make sure you share i'll see you in part three